Okay, do's and do that's. Folks, look where we are, HMS Victory. Wow. Ooh. I actually should have done a little entrance to the, most than to the entry actually. Um, but uh, how cool is this? Awesome. HMS Victory. Way. Right, I'll, I'll catch you guys in a bit. Bye for now. So we're now on board the HMS Victory. And as you can see, what an amazing ship. She's huge and all, like I said. Wow. I mean, can you imagine if you're on deck and then you come into some port somewhere? I mean, wow. This is amazing. The size of the anchor. Look at that. It's huge. Can you imagine working and living aboard something like this? Look at the block and tackle things and wow, this is pretty awesome, man. Wow. Oh, look at that. Look at that big ship there. Oh, look at that big ship. Oh, I like a kid at Warsaw. Oh, wow, look. Big ship, big ship. <laughs> you can't appreciate the fact that I don't, you know, obviously I don't live near the, the sea or anything and I don't see big ships uh, very often. So to see them in the flesh, floating past like that, as big as a house or even bigger, you know what I mean? It's like, for me, that's, uh, you know, it's a thrill. It's an amazing thrill. Look, look, look at the mast. I wonder if she was a sailing ship originally. I presume she was a sailing ship, ship originally. Uh, I guess they just, she ain't fully rigged, I guess. I must admit, I have no idea. I wouldn't know. I haven't got a clue. See, there's loads of these ships all over the place. There's another one down there. But each one that you, you know, what's it, you got to pay to go in. Um, now, like I say, you can do it individually. Like I just did this uh, on the tour thing. Um, but uh, for the whole site, and including the submarine thing that we went to and all the rest of it, um, it's 33 quid. I think it's worth, well worth it, to be perfectly honest with you. Because there's so much to see. Do you know what I mean? Um, I think it is well worth it. 33 quid for all of this, definitely. Definitely. Including the submarine and all the rest of it. Absolutely. So, right, the wind's blowing, so it's going to sound a little bit noisy on here. Um, right. Look at this. Look at the rigging. Look at the rigging. Wow. Awesome. That's amazing. Look at the cannons. Wow. Can you imagine when those were firing? Can you imagine it? Wow, all the smoke and dust and, and all the rest of it. Wow, and the noise, of course. Can you imagine the noise. Wow. Oh, look, massive big wheel. That's awesome, isn't it? Wow. Look, look, look at this. Wow. Oh, we're going to the stern, of course. Uh, where we filmed earlier on to look at that thing. Oh wow, look at this. I wish, like I say guys, I wish you had smelly vision. Because there's an amazing smell in here. Oh look at this. It's like a little cop. Like, wow, that's, that's what you call a hammock. <laughs> wow. This is obviously where the captain would reside originally. Obviously. And look, look at this. There's even a cannon in here. <laughs> wow. Look at these windows, I love these windows. Wow. Oh, this is amazing. Look at that view. Wow. I can't remember whose ship, was it Lord Nelson? Was this Nelson's ship? I, mean, I think it was, you know. I'm not too sure, but I imagine I'm walking where Lord Nelson walked. Can you imagine that? You can hear people walking upstairs. That is so cool. Look, look at this. And there's a telescope, of course. This must be like the ward room or something, I guess. Right, look at the hat. Look, I don't know what kind of hat you call that, but obviously sort of something that Nelson would wear. And this furniture, look. Wow. How cool is that? Look, a decanter over there. 
presumably you had, uh, what's the name in it? This is amazing. This is awesome. This is awesome. Look at that wheel. <laughs> Lash the wheel. <laughs> yeah. Right, guys. I'll leave it there for now. Uh, and I'll catch you guys later. Bye for now.